All right, how y'all doing? My name's Ari Bedell, and this is a tutorial for bubble toes. And what we're gonna do first is we're gonna start off on the uh, D power, uh, D, yeah, D power chord. And what's it gonna be? It's gonna be on the fifth and um, seventh of the fifth and fourth string. So your pointer finger is gonna be on the fifth fret of the fifth string, and your third finger is gonna be on the seventh fret of the fourth string. Then you're gonna move it up one string to the uh, fifth fret and seventh fret. So it's still all the same fret, you're just moving it all up one string. That's an A. It's an A5. Then you go down to an E which is going to be on the 5th and 4th string, and it's going to be on the 7th and ninth fret. So your pointer's on the 7th, and your 3rd string's on the ninth. Then you're going to go to a C, which a C is on the... You're going to go up one string, and you're going to slide it down to the 8th and 10th, and that's a C. So it's going to go from the E to a C. That's the 8th and 10th fret of the 6th um, and 5th string. So the verse goes, at the start, the verses go like this. And you kind of do a slap in between. What I do is I just take my pointer finger, and I just kind of slap it across, and I kind of mute it with my palm. That might take a little practice to do. And what you do right after the, you get done with the C on the second time through, you go to a G5 which is just going to be on the 3rd fret of the 6th string and the 5th fret of the 5th string. Then you're going to move, you're going to keep that, you're going to keep on that 3rd fret, you're going to move to the 7th on the 5th string, then the 8th, then back to the 7th. So you're going to go 5, 7, 8, 7. From there, you're going to go back to the verses. time through of doing this little riff right here, you go, you play it twice, and after you play it twice, you go to the main riff, which is the rest of the song. Well, that's going to be an actual G power chord, but you're going to have an E formation with the first, your pinky, these three fingers, you're going to have an E formation but you're just going to bar the top with your pointer finger, the entire third fret. Then you're going to play a C, a C power chord, which is going to be, you're going to bar the two strings right here for, for the C, and you're going to keep the rest of the top barred with your pointer finger, except the sixth string, which you're going to mute with that pointer finger. Then you're going to slide down to a D, which is the same shape, except it's on the 5th and 7th. So basically, here is the rhythm down here. I don't really, I can't really say it in words, but this is how I, this is how I think it goes. And for these are who are visual learners instead of auditory learners, you can just uh, watch, watch my hand and you can figure it out. Keep that slap going with my pointer finger. I, I use the rhythm with my thumb, with my pointer finger I keep the slap. And you kind of, during the, that rhythm, you kind of add pressure to your G power chord here release it. You can see my fingers moving up here. That's me adding pressure and releasing pressure. That kind of helps the rhythm out a little bit. And during that part, after those verses, after the first like two verses, he does a little kind of solo thing. A little... That's 
That little part is just, it's very simple. All you have is you have a third fret, you play it twice, and you go from the fifth, you go to the fifth string, this is on the sixth string, third fret, sixth string, twice, fifth string, second fret, and you're gonna hammer on to the third fret of the fifth string, and you're gonna slide it down to the fifth fret of the fifth string, then you go back to that G, or the sixth string, third fret. Then you go all the way down here to the seventh fret, fifth string, Play that twice, slide it to the 9, or the 9th ninth fret, ninth fret, then you go back to the 7th, then the 5th, then the 3rd, then the G. So all that is is a little... There's not a little gap in between there, my brain's just not even fast enough for it. the song for Bubble Toes. I hope this helps you. Alrighty, take it easy.